This is the first trial project we undertook to check the piston movement produced by the waves where the piston was a syringe. Hello everyone. This is a model representing the functioning of the mechanism which would generate electricity from floating buoys. Here firstly we show the structure of one such unit. As you can see this white color structure is the buoy which is connected to a piston arrangement vertically below it. Now this piston has a rack that is a vertical long gear attached to itself. And then you can see that the rack is meshed with the other gears which are then connected to the dynamo which is used for electricity production which is in the alternating current form. This dynamo is connected to the multimeter showing electricity generation. As the waves will move the buoy, the vertical motion it receives is transferred to the piston and then through the rack and pinion arrangement to the dynamo which produces electricity as is shown here. Now here is the underwater footage of the apparatus. As you can see, the electricity being generated in the multimeter is in the alternating current form and the apparatus is all underwater. Finally, this is over the surface view. And now you can also see the electricity generation in the multimeter. Hello everyone, this is a simulated model of the floating buoy mechanism we propose. Firstly, as you can see here, the vertical motion of the piston is converted to rotatory by the rack and pinion arrangement. This rotatory motion which is oscillatory in nature is used by the dynamo or electric generator to produce electricity which is AC in nature. Now, as we can see here, the vertical motion of the piston is provided by this float or buoy which harnesses energy in the form of vertical motion from the sea waves. Finally, in the lowermost part of the whole system which acts as an anchor, it is a heavy weight structure either bound to the ocean floor in shallow seas or it just acts as a weight to keep the lower buoy mechanism still. Thank you for watching.